I show three methods to cut glass bottles. Method number one. Make sure the cap of the bottle is off. Materials. A flammable liquid. A lighter or matches. String. Wrap the string around the bottle a few times and tie it. Cut off the extra string. Take the string off the bottle. Soak the string in the flammable liquid. Put the string back on the bottle. I used a cup and a chopstick to make the string level around the bottle. Light the string on fire and spin the bottle around. After the flame dies down, dip the bottle in cold water. The bottle should break where the string was. This method can be a hit or miss, usually producing a pretty jagged cut line. If it's not too jagged, it can be cleaned up with some sandpaper. I've found the other methods produce better results. Method number two. Materials. Glass cutter. A roll of tape or an object you want the height of the cut to be at. The bottle I used fits perfectly into the tape roll. I took the tip of the glass cutter off to get better control. Hold the cutter to the bottle and slowly spin the bottle around. Once the line is scored around the bottle, take it out. Hold the score line about a quarter of an inch over the flame while slowly spinning the bottle. After it's heated up, rub an ice cube around the score line. Repeat this until the bottle breaks apart. You should see the bottle start to fracture around the score line. If it doesn't break after a while, you can lightly pull the top and bottom of the bottle apart. This method usually produces a pretty straight cut line. Method number three, using a bottle cutter. The bottle cutter can be store-bought or homemade. Adjust the cutter to where you want the bottle to be cut at. Rotate the bottle towards you. You should hear a crunching sound as it cuts.
Use the same way to break the bottle apart used in the second method. You can sand the edges to make drinking cups, or use the cup bottles in other projects. 